My name is Dr. Pamela Twitty. I'm an OBGYN physician and I currently work out of St. Joseph's Hospital North. I feel very privileged to be able to offer women in the Tampa Bay area uh, options for minimally invasive procedures of which in my training have included minimally invasive surgeries through regular laparoscopy as well as robotic surgery. The differences between uh, traditional uh, abdominal surgery versus robotic surgery are primarily the incisions that are made. There have been some recent advancements in robotic surgery, of which is primarily the single site technology that's become available uh, to both general surgeons as well as GYN surgeons. The single site incision is one small incision that goes through the patient's navel that allows for the instrument to pass through this one incision to achieve um, surgical outcomes that are similar to what were done previously through more than one incision or large incisions that uh, occupied more space on the patient's abdomen. Traditional surgery, for instance, in my field, GYN, gynecology, uh, a hysterectomy was previously done through uh, an incision on the patient's abdomen that was anywhere from 5 to 10 to 12 inches long, depending on what was needed. And uh, the robotic surgery allows for similar types of procedures to be done through several small incisions through the patient's abdomen that are no, long, no longer each than about a, a centimeter to one, one to two centimeters, excuse me. And this allows for patients' recovery times to be better, faster, uh, less re recuperative pain, and uh, the patients are returning back to their normal activities and daily lives faster. Uh, many of the patients, upwards uh, to 80% or more, are able to go home in less than 24 hours from the hospital uh, after their surgery is completed. The cosmetic outcome is, is nearly uh, invisible. The ideal patient for robotic hysterectomy uh, are uh, women who essentially need a hysterectomy for the most part. There are some circumstances where a robotic hysterectomy may not be the right option for, for a woman, uh, depending on what her anatomy is, depending on what the size of her uterus or, or her mass may be. So currently single site uh, da Vinci surgery for GYM purposes is guided more towards uh, benign disease. Women who need a hysterectomy for benign pur purposes, whether that's bleeding or fibroids or uh, endometriosis or they have masses on their ovaries or fallopian tubes that need to be removed and, and can be feasibly done through the single site approach. The uniqueness of the robotics team with St. Joseph's Hospitals I believe is the comprehensiveness in which we're able to offer patients of various ages, various genders, as well as various needs, uh, an opportunity to receive a minimally invasive surgical option instead of uh, an open abdominal procedure as their surgical need uh, dictates.